Running a wholesale business can be a little bit of a nightmare. You've got to manage thousands of products, customers, orders, shipments, warehouses, the list goes on. But a good inventory management app can streamline your operations and help your business run like a well-oiled machine. Now I'm speaking from experience here because it was only a few years ago that I took my family's wine business from spreadsheets and sticky notes to apps and automations. And this helped us become the number one Italian wine importer in Hong Kong for many years in a row. But a lot has changed since then, especially in the world of no code and AI. So today, I'm going to show you how to build an inventory management app you can talk to. An app that allows your staff to arm themselves with the information they need to open more accounts, close more deals, and make smarter decisions with nothing more than their voice. You ready? Let's jump in. This is the back end of my inventory management app. Just a few years ago, building a complex and data heavy app like this would take months and cost you a small fortune. By contrast, what you're looking at now took me an afternoon to build. It tracks inventory in multiple warehouses, groups purchase orders into various shipments, tracks my sales orders, and much, much more. But this isn't your average inventory management app. This app has been infused with powerful AI functionality to take it to the next level. For example, each wine has one or more grape varietals. Let's jump into that table. In this column, I've asked AI to generate a short and concise description of each grape, commenting on its origin, flavor profile, and any other interesting facts. These descriptions are then used in my wine table to create wine descriptions that will have you salivating. Here's how that works. The grape descriptions for each wine are imported into my wine table as a join list. This list is then being injected into a template column to create a prompt. And this prompt is then being used in an OpenAI column that sends the prompt to ChatGPT and returns a description so compelling and delicious, you'll be able to taste what you're reading. Now, what you've just seen is incredibly powerful and it's gonna save you hours and hours of copywriting. But what I'm about to reveal now feels like magic. Let me set the scene. You're a newly hired sales rep and you're about to hit the streets of Hong Kong to do some wine tastings. You've just joined the company, so you're not really familiar with their wine list and you wanna make sure that you're bringing the best wines to each of these tastings. The other employees are busy with their own tasks and the boss is in the middle of a meeting. So you don't wanna bother them with mundane questions, distracting them from what they're focusing on. So you whip out your phone, open your guide app, click record and leave a voice message. All right, so I'm on the way to a seafood restaurant. Which would be the best wine to recommend to this restaurant? Now this is where the magic happens. The AI is then gonna query your entire wine database, searching for the perfect wine. And based on the AI generated descriptions we created earlier, give you a response in a matter of seconds. Boom, there we go. It's recommended the Etna Bianco, a delicious white wine from Sicily that is perfect for seafood. But promoting a wine that's out of stock is probably not a good idea. So before we get too excited, let's make sure we've got good stock of this wine. Great, and how many bottles of the Etna Bianco do we currently have in stock? Again, this is gonna query your entire wine database and give you an answer faster than it takes to write a WhatsApp message to your assistant. Excellent, we've got plenty of stock, but we don't wanna recommend a wine that they're already buying. So let's quickly check when they last bought the Etna Bianco. And when was the last time the Greek seafood restaurant purchased the Etna Bianco 2020? This is now gonna query our orders table, searching through each and every row to give us an answer. And there you have it. The last time they bought this wine was on the 8th of March. So it's probably not the best wine to bring along for a tasting. And thanks to Glide's AI, we've saved ourselves the embarrassment of recommending a wine they're already buying. The fact that I'm able to build an app this powerful in an afternoon is mind blowing. An app like this gives you or your client's business an unfair advantage of monstrous proportions. And it was built in Glide without code in a matter of hours. So if you want me to build you an app, or you want to level up your glide skills, head to lowcode.com. My name is Marco. Thanks for watching.